originally, and um, yeah, it's a completely different team. Like so much has changed really? in the last two years. They yeah. have improved dramatically. Oh, cool. Okay, Good so that's the start okay, there. Let's see. And the Wales have the ball. It was a really quick start. Both teams got the ball at about the same time. Um, so now we've got a little bit of scrum. Okay. <laughs> this is a quite a typical start says, yeah. in rugby. But all right, now the ball's free. They're heading straight towards the goal. And there's some really strong forechecking there from the forwards of the Boston team. Who do you guess could win this this game from what we have seen in, in the Champions Cup so far? I think it's going to be a really close one. Um, yeah, right. I also have that feeling but too. A ver, ahí están atacando. Ahí hizo un uh, bloqueo y el it was I think a that goal. Was Scott Phillip. Hold no, on, something that's happened. Uh, Can't hear the. I hope okay. So something throw, happened okay. and there's a free throw. Uh, probably some kind of um, attack a mask or um, yes, typically. Things happen it was around the clock. Sunday, 2:30 a.m. in Australia. So thank you. Yeah, that's what I meant. I mean, <laughs> hey, Jared. <laughs> How you doing? So we've got. Is that? That's uh, who the tattoo. Seven. That must that's be Steve. Number yep. seven. Ah, so you so know that's Steve Kilpatrick. Cool. That's why you got me here. Okay, so Steve's passport. <laughs> I think that is Per Solabake, and they've got a really good attack going here. I mean, they haven't gone too close to the basket but they're definitely in control of the ball yeah they they had a block before and they were really close yeah they had a free uh lane to the to the to the goalie and they're staying low and getting the defenders sort of like high up in the water yeah. um and then new players are coming in swimming under that yep but we have the boston guys into position nevertheless i mean yeah. they have to be very very careful because so far uh, Wales is creating chaos, and if they don't don't focus and are disciplined and, and, and you know doing the changes, uh, they can create a gap. I mean, meaning that the Australian guys and okay, score. Okay, so let's see. There is good still pass time down. Yep. Oh, good for checking by Boston team. Norka got lost. Let's see if we can okay. see the referees in the middle. Okay, so we have a little bit of a counter attack by Boston, but they couldn't hold on to the ball. Now it's passed. Okay, we're starting over again. So the Wales are going to renew their attack. Some of the players are pretty tired and will be swimming back and changing. So they're really kind of um, playing this corner strategy there, uh, which is good. It's good to slow the pace of the game down um, and not just yeah, to get go into the air. basket. Well, exactly, but then you can get air regroup and start the attack exactly. again right and do a couple of waves if you want to probably if you are very tight on the quality of the level of the team then you need to have moments where you create really you go in a couple of minutes to create uh, the, the mistake to force a mistake on the other team and otherwise you can always it won't happen you can always tell the uh, difference between an experienced team and an inexperienced team because it takes experience to you know actually be able to pull back and slow the game exactly. down and then St stay in, in the possession of ball and we have a free throw to yep. the boston Narwhals. all right okay let's see if they can hold on to the ball for a while and do an attack on the whales okay so the whales are playing a cool not going too far out of the basket Oh, they're piercing, oh. defending, really good job. Really good forward checking, they just got the ball back. And I think the ball's been swam out, so it's going to be a free throw to Boston again for out of play. And as you can see uh, from newer viewers, um, even though there's a free throw called, um, play doesn't really stop. Like, uh, you've got to yep. guard your basket because... Uh, before the free throw, a lot of strategic things can happen, like you know the opponents can steal your basket from you. Um, oh, so we have a really yeah, dangerous just situation here. Yeah, oh, that was, that was really, really, really close. Risky, yep. Hats off to the goalie for um, for being able to respond to that and stay on the goal and sort of spin uh, himself around there. Oh, good okay. job from the defender, keeping the ball and trying to you know bring the away from the basket. Okay, so so let's this could see. be either really good or really dangerous for the Wales because. Yeah. They committed all the players to the counter-attack. That player, I don't know what number he is, but from the Boston Owls, he's a really, the player with the ball right now, uh, he's definitely one of the stronger players on their team. 
excellent ball handling and really good game reading. Okay, a good intercept of the pass by the Wales. Let's see if they can swim it to the other side and uh, and try and get a few more goal opportunities. It's going to be a tight one, really. Yeah, I mean, it's <laughs> my I, I, I heart I'm is I'm pounding. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm and sorry, I'm also caught. I'm, like, I'm not breathing. I realize yeah. I'm like. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so you're either talking or you're thinking. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> so where we are, we are on the. Uh, We're right in the middle of the pool, yes, pretty much. On the side and of the wall. And both teams are contesting the ball. The ball. I had lots of um, and as you can see, once you take the ball to the surface, it gets really hard to like get the ball down into the water again because that's where everyone is. Um, and Boston is doing a good job also being on time, in position, and yes. trying to keep the ball aside. I mean, at the beginning, it got da really dangerous really quick, so now they are being a bit more cautious and keeping yeah. the Australians yeah. a little bit far. Oh, good, good opportunity. Two guys just behind yes, a great yes, pass. Get it in. It's oh. coming from the head of the goalie. That was, that was super close. Okay, what? so the goal's been stolen oh. now. If they can get the ball down to the person who stole the goal, and we have then that could be an Boston easy. Guys, well, that uh, took too long. <sighs> three minutes and 40 seconds. What uh, was the situation when you came? Which position did you do in the Champions Cup? Uh, uh, last that time, you we you, you were not last. I think it was like seven. I mean, like somewhere no, in the last think, third, right? I think we came ninth, but okay. it was nine like out of 13 teams. 13, exactly, yeah. exactly, exactly. So this, uh, I believe, this game is for ninth place. Yeah. This way, this play, let me see. Yes, that's, you're right. And yeah. the final for the nap when the but play is number nine. This will be, if they win this, if the Wales win this, this will be nine out of 15 rather than nine out of 13. Yeah. So that will be a significant yeah. improvement. De definitely, yep. Okay, so that's Scott Phillip going above the goal and passing the ball down. At the back, responded really quickly and shifted over. Okay, so they're putting really good pressure oh, on the Boston team, but the Boston team have Boston got a solid defense. Good, yes. Yes, okay, they know so what they're doing too. All right, we're slowing the pace back down again. Yes, okay, this oh is an opportunity. Yeah, but it's missing them. Uh, th they, ha they have to play the ball a bit faster. Yeah, but that was a good reflex was, from yes. the uh, Boston defender who yes, pulled the leg back. Yes, 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 yeah. It really completely stopped the motion of that yep. action. Otherwise, it would have been differ difficult. One against three. three. Going up. If you can keep the ball, that will give them a numerical advantage underwater. Okay, so a free uh, throw has been called for, for some kind of roughing or yeah, holding. They, I couldn't see the sign of the referee. It's just free throw. And we have two minutes and something, right. some seconds left. And let's, let's see if Austria... Put some more Australia pressure on them. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, boys. Kinda let's cheap. give 110% here. 150. If you're going to ask us for 100%. Oh no, we're, <laughs> <laughs> we're, really, we're really humble and we've got a lot of humility, so we just, uh, we just give 110. Just 110. Yeah. <laughs> 150, that's too much. <laughs> no one needs that much. Okay, okay. nice counter go. attack oh, by the Boston cool. Narwhals. Uh, four checked midway. I think the Wales might have won the ball back, but they've kind of uh, clamped up there. Um, okay, ball's dropped to the bottom. Okay, it's a well. Wales ball now. Oh! Little bit of a disappointing pass there. Oh, okay, great nice. recovery from okay. 21. You know who he is? 21. I have it here. Let me check. I suspect he might be uh, a Colombian Australian oh. player. Well, no? There's no 21. You know, they have sent this rooster a while ago, and <laughs> I think that I haven't updated. Yeah. Okay, so two against three on the bus. Okay. Oh, one no, minute 13. One that three one's defenders. almost getting lost. Australia's giving okay, everything so they have. 21 is still trying to attack. Oh. But all of the Boston guys are onto that Australian guy. And now the ball is kind of lost I mean, behind the bubbles. And I can't see. And the basket is kind of... One. Oh, my God. Goal, Go, was it? Yes, goal for Australia. It was strange. The buzzer kind of came before we saw the ball go in. We saw that they were fighting there for the goalie with the ball and we couldn't see the ball. I think maybe the sound's behind, a little bit um, behind the gameplay, the sound. Well, not the transmission. We are a few right, seconds okay. behind and sure. then the people at home are like even a bit, a yeah. little <laughs> bit behind. <laughs> okay. Um, All right. So, so that is fantastic. Um, I was going to say head start, but no, we're already like <laughs> nine and a half minutes into this game now. So we're... Um, no, it's the last 18 seconds for yeah, the first yeah. half, so... So it's good that they're able to um, force a goal. 
uh, in the first half. This will put the Boston Owls um, <laughs> basically on the toes. They need to score in the second half. Okay, so One. this is... Okay, end of the first half. Free throw, it was free throw against uh, Australia, but uh, it's uh, the end of the first half. So yeah. now it's two minutes, 40 seconds for you to breathe and recover. <laughs> oh, I'm going to need a drink. <laughs> I there you go. Thank you. <laughs> and uh, do you remember from two years ago, what was the most challenging thing you had? Because that was the first time mm. an Australian uh, team came, yeah, if I don't remember wrong. Yep. And what were you expecting and what did you find? And uh, what were the most difficult games? I mean, do you remember a little bit of that uh, experience? Because it's yeah. difficult uh, two years later, but... So I think uh, two years ago, that was, the, uh, that was um, our second time playing in an international competition um, because before that we were in Cali okay. and um, and then a lot of those players who were in Cali uh, came and played with For us two World years Cup. ago yep. 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 and I mean <laughs> that was a <laughs> that was a whole new experience for us like you know getting to play against clubs like Colombia and Norway um, and then last year we kind of expected more of the same like you know same level of intensity yeah. as the World Championships um, and it was, but it's you know, very different. Yeah, and it wasn't that small bad. Pool. I mean, because you have no, yeah, small pools. Short games. Um, yeah. yeah, it's, I think um, it was a lot more fun. Like, yeah. we didn't um, stress about it as much as uh, maybe we were with the World with Championships. The World Cup, yeah. of course, and yeah. we had a little bit more experience yeah. then. Um, so, yeah, we, um, we had a really good experience. Cool. And mm. uh, that no, that's great because then that uh, promotes uh, the sport more. I mean, uh, last year I believe there was no Australian team coming. And last year there year was. There was. Then yeah, from Perth. Perth. Perth, Perth of course. Yeah. Sorry. I mean <laughs> so <laughs> it's been Wales, uh, yeah, Perth, that's Wales. That's amazing that after yeah. that uh, first time you came, that you know the the whole country like is bored into oh let's go to the Champions Cup and let's try to play against those guys yeah. and trying to save the money during the year. And yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's it's a lot of money um, to play rugby in Australia. Just pool hire and uh, and all the travel. Like you know, if you want to get good, you have to go to tournaments, right? Yes, and yes, in yes, Australia, yes. you don't have uh, the flights aren't as cheap as you know flying from. Um, and you have how many teams do you have in Australia? Please. Say we have. Um, I think we have eight active teams. Okay. Yeah. Eight active so teams, and they are like all in the coast. Are you really far away, or pretty? They're in the major cities. So we've got teams all along and down the east coast and then we've got Adelaide and okay. uh, and Perth and then Tasmania um and so just for us a little bit ignorant people that don't you know have I mean I we I come from Argentina so we have yeah. big distances but in, in Europe it's very different so that means like if you want to do a tournament with some of the guys how many hours would you be you would be flying probably not driving right uh <laughs> or, I mean exactly <laughs> like you <laughs> no well, I mean oh. some people do drive and okay. they're the crazy ones okay, okay wait okay, let's come back yeah. to this uh, start of the second half here. Um, once again, both teams really quick to the ball, kind of get there at exactly the same time as each other. Uh, and now they just have to kind of fight it out in the middle to see who gets possession. Yeah, exactly, Rolexi. Thank you so much for that. It's a semi final to fight for the place number nine. Exactly. So it, it hasn't been defined yet. It was not the final for the place eight and nine. But I, I think mean, this is the audience. It's frozen. Yep. Okay. <laughs> is this the last game they play? Like. No, well, this is a semi-final to okay. see who plays for place number nine. Oh, okay, so... Okay. It's not the final, it's a semi-final. Right, right. So Thank you for that clarification. No, it's okay, it's... Uh, let's see, we I'm sorry I'm um, caught up on the game, I'm not even reading the comments here. Um, yeah, it's okay, don't worry, I can take yeah. care of that <laughs> and you... you concentrate on the okay. game. Though now we are on the basket uh, of oh, the Australian team and they just that got that pass, great swim out interception. From the goalie. Yep. And oh, but counterattacks can be um, sometimes can they can be a bit of a mixed blessing. Like <laughs> <laughs> if it if it goes right, you know, That's a it's nice word. great. But um, <laughs> if you swim it out halfway and you stuff it up, then <laughs> okay. There we have Boston guys trying to you know some more pressure because they are 1-0 down. Australia is winning the semi-final as now, but the second half just started, So, and these teams are really tight, so anything can happen yet. Although Australia have been uh, been more assertive in the attack and have been, uh, been able to put more pressure in the Boston basket in the first half. So let's see, where's the ball, what happened? Good chanting from uh, the supporters on yeah. the bench. <laughs> 
what is I cannot hear where they're uh, are they supporters is it Australia or is yeah they're Australian they're shouting Wales ah okay yeah so <laughs> but this is with an accent yeah. <laughs> sorry oh okay this is uh, the Wales first attack on the narwhals in the second half oh, have it holds the Boston team at the bottom there oh the ball was wow that was oh. really a good recovery from the yep. Boston and I have he's trying to fight against two guys of Australia and the Australians are giving everything because it's one zero so that gives you also the edge and oh, everything like ben this ball grabs is the ball. Okay. great oh, pass the go straight for board. the goal son go straight for the goal don't swim Come down to the back. Alone against four, and he's being clamored <laughs> there. Get that ball and out. Oh, he's still in possession yes. of the ball. Could pass it. There were a lot of quick hands there. Oh, great okay. recovery. I mean, Australia is still in possession of the ball, and Boston needs to come right, and put it into position. No, oh. come on. Stop with those crappy passes. <laughs> <sighs> Come on, focus guys, focus. But the score, the score is one zero for Wales right now. For people asking, some people were saying hi to you, Bobby, like uh, Kia, Jao Ki, yeah, and uh, hey Jackie, Key? yeah, yes, yeah. <laughs> hey Jax, what's the time over he's there in he's California? He's distracted by the game. <laughs> <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, free throw to the Boston Narwhals. Uh, how see. much time we got left here? Uh, we can't see, but I would even dare to say like around seven minutes or so. Yeah, okay. Something like this. For, for some reason, they uh, forgot to. So the interesting the thing is that the Wales, they're not, you know, um, they have a small lead now, but they're yeah. still playing very aggressively. Aus yeah. Australia is dominating the game. Right now, I mean, they are more in possession of the ball and they yes, are much yes, more come on, on the come basket. On. Let's do this. <laughs> So the camera right. is happening, Australia is attacking from the closer but just lost the ball into the defender. Yes, the yes, next yes. Is go, under go, the go, 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 pass passing it. to the other on the opener, is trying to, but Boston is defending first. The ball is against the basket and the wall. The Australian just oh. got the ball and uh, it's pull, been pulled up to the surface. That was that a is close a clutch one. Moment. Dangerous for Boston. Boston, if they want to get this game, they need to recover the ball and try to create some pressure in the Australian hands, but Australia is not giving up I mean any second. So, the Wales have dominated possession so far, but like, still in terms of like the skill difference between these two teams, it's really, we're only really talking about like a 5 or 7% difference here, like. Oh, that camera is a little bit uh, dying out. All right, so uh, we can't see right now the um, goal area of Australia, but the okay. guys just recovered the ball, so hopefully they bring us to the camera that's Wait, working. Wait, is this swimming the wrong way? This is uh, Australia, and we need to go here for Boston, yep, to yep. the left. So um, let's see, the Australian arch... Uh, uh, let's see. Okay. The yeah, he got the ball, is in the counter-attack, yes, and the Boston yes. guys on, camera, be camera. fine. And now we yep. have three against one. Pull Where leg, is the leg. team play? I mean, get the ball out. it yes. was important to get there quicker for the counter attack. Nevertheless, uh, okay. Australia go, is go, one go. I mean, in between. Come on, pass it down. Pass it down. And oh. uh, still, Boston is All recovering, right. but it's always one second behind. And it's been getting really stressful oh. for them. We have now two against two. Okay. And then we have the Australian nice. right under the goal. Oh. And that, whoa, that was uh, too much pushing to the side and not from the bottom okay. to the top. So Third time lucky, come on. I mean, Third come time on. lucky. Third time is a charm. Third time is a charm. But Boston is doing a great oh job. Wow. And it's oh my God. I mean how did I'm that so stay on? Uh, uh, because the attack was too much to the side. You could see how the body of the goalie moved towards the wall yeah. and not up. So it was, I mean, he was pushing to the side. And he was a little but bit too high. That was the same goalie who survived three attacks, wasn't it? Well, but it, um, well, I, don't re I don't remember. <laughs> Uh, they probably have the 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 the, the wall here, so you you know they cannot yeah, go so anywhere. Yeah. If you are uh, from one of the right or the left side, and you can push it toward the other side, but when it's between from the middle toward the okay, wall. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Give him the and ball. And let's see, we have all the Aussies uh, there. The Aussies are so hungry right now. <laughs> Be like <laughs> yeah, they're looking at the goal as if it's a bunning I sausage sizzle. I don't see Boston really having uh, a chance unless uh, uh, Australia um, is late in the counter attack. It's looked good for Come the on. Australian team. It's 1 0. Let's get some bunning sausages, guys. Uh, 
Oh, so yeah. we can't really see how much time is left, oh, can we? Three minutes three left. Three minutes left, just, okay. Uh, they hear you, they hear you. Less than right. three minutes left in Australia. Need to keep that ball. Slow but the they they want to score. I mean, they <laughs> the best defense is the attack, and they're doing that great. They're putting so much pressure on. Yeah. And I mean, and Boston cannot even yeah. get leave the area. I mean, they're really like glued to the, their basket, and that ball almost was missed. Yes, the Aussie, yes, but come on. Under the goalie, and then the goalie from above oh. is pushing. Look like there was no shoulder switching. there. Let's see, now the ball is on the surface and I don't see a lot of uh, I mean a lot of the players, maybe they change and now they're uh, two or two fighting the goalie of the Boston team is in position, they are right there above the goalie of the Boston. <laughs> we just got intel uh, from one of the volunteers here that the atmosphere in the pool is, oh my god! Yes. I mean. Yes. Pass it to him. Two minutes. Two minutes, and with this, uh, we have the make Aussie this right Make this happen, guys. Let's make this happen. But Boston is really getting there in the middle, and it's making it difficult. Oh that God. ball is not <laughs> willing to get in, and oh. now it's in the hands of the Boston team. And now, um, let's see. They it's have one white and one blue fighting, going toward the surface. All right. So. Pretty much the last five minutes <laughs> has just been the Wales on the attack non-stop. Uh, every time Boston now Wales get the ball back, uh, they don't get to hold on to it for more than, you know, 10, 15 seconds. Uh, let's see if they can manage to break out of their own defensive zone here. No, once again, Wales have got the ball back, but, I mean, it's there's a lot of pressure. Um, it's not easy for them to oh get close to the basket. Oh, two against one. Come on, you can okay. do this. One minute, pass it. Pass it, push it from the bottom, oh. and whoa, lost the ball, and the Boston guy is bringing it to the surface and towards the other side of the pool. Okay, I think there's a referee call here for... Um, yeah, and like grabbing the mask, free yeah. throw for Australia, Australia, so not everything is lost. So there's only 50 seconds left on the game. <laughs> um, yeah, you can imagine the atmosphere um, by the side Bobby of the pool is, is on uh, a knife edge. Oh, what happened? Timeout. Okay. Timeout so probably blue, yes. Boston just asked for a timeout. Maybe they want All to right. <laughs> Bobby, you have a timeout <laughs> you can bring yeah. to. <laughs> well, we knew, we knew it was going to be a very close game, but yeah. uh, I didn't know it was going to be this close. Like Really? You yeah. thought it was going like to be well. better for the Australia, maybe... I was not. hoping. Oh, what you yeah. hoping, yeah. Um, it's always hard to judge. I mean, like, um, teams differ from year to year. Yes. Like yeah, definitely. Yeah. I mean, I mean for above all these teams that are still new and building up, yeah. you know, so there's a huge difference. Especially when like teams are, you know, sort of, um, you know, when you get a team like Mulder, like they don't sort of improve 50% from one year to another. But uh, when you get newer teams like in Australia, they do, you can come back, yeah. yeah. In one year, so yeah. much can happen. Definitely, yes. And this is definitely the strongest team we've ever produced. The T oh, the game is on, camera, please camera, take it, change into okay. the... Change into the water. <laughs> we need to see on the water, please. You guys, we're flying blind here. You're killing me. Please, can you put the uh, game at uh, there? Okay, we are. okay, thank you. All right, so they're about Wha to resume. Why is the clock? Uh, it, I think it's they're just resuming from the free throw. So with 50 yes. seconds left. Okay, but I thought the time would start. Anyway, right. no, it's okay. It's a running time, so it's. Uh, okay, so it'll be interesting to see if the Aussies please are going to keep trying to score here, or if they're just going to hold on to the ball. <laughs> we can <laughs> we can hear the future. <laughs> okay, so the goal has been stolen. We have four. Can three, they get the ball down two, to the person? One. It doesn't matter. One, we got zero. this. Australia <laughs> won. Go you good things. And Bobby played the, t the game together. Oh, what a ripper. Great, great uh, match. 1-0. That was great, Lorena. Yeah. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> I'm happy for you. Uh, you. Do you know the people from Singapore a bit or not? I know a few of them. Yeah. Because there's next coming up. So if you want uh, oh, to playing? comment or you want to go and celebrate with the women. I have to, uh, I have to ask my, uh, my boss, uh, Lisa, over there. Okay. Lisa? Lisa? Are you cool with me commentating the Singapore game as well? Are you cool with me commentating the Singapore game as well, or do you want me on the deck? Signal's doing it? Okay, cool. I'll, I'll stay then. 
should be um, for the scores in here. Yeah, let me see. Okay. Okay, I, I write it down right here. So right. now it's coming up the semi final for the ninth place for the women, and it's the yeah. Fatties, I mean, Singapore girls against the Swiss girls. So let's see, if I, uh, let me find the rooster there for the girls. And uh, Bobby's recovering, I think. He's <laughs> 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 like, <laughs> wow, I need some more ice. Elvetia. Let's so that's see. the Swiss girls? The Swiss girls are following. Number two, Sandra Vogel. Six, Simone Buchler. Number 10, Judith uh, Buckley. Number 17, Anna Sutinova. Number 22, Ellen Reif. 24, Helena e Ehi. 33, Tamara Cal Cavelti. 42, Katrin Hayerly. 87, Isabel Morgenstern. And we said the Singapore girls, let's see what we have them here. We have number one. Oh, maybe you are better on this than I, or not. Uh, I, I guess on number one we've got Fatin uh, Binta Rosli. Uh, number three, we have uh, Cheng Cheng uh, or Mia. Uh, number four, we've got um, Tang Rei uh, Number five, we've got Alice Chong. Number six, we have Kaiser Engblom. Uh, number seven, we have Helena C. Number 10, we have Genevieve Yell. Number 11, Dawn New. Ah, that's how you pronounce no, it. No, don't, no, oh, okay. I, I, I don't know. I'm <laughs> I just, mean, ask it. I'm just putting it on a brave face. Okay. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> number 12, we've got Annabelle Tan. Uh, 15, uh, Hitomi, uh, Hitomi Litsuka. Yep, he looks uh, 19, Michaela uh, Verbel. Mm -hmm. And 22, Jacqueline Ong. Okay, in G. Which kind of family name is that you know I mean uh, it's a Vietnamese name I believe Vietnamese okay yeah. great I mean I'm so curious I mean we have this uh, like Finnish language I am amused I look at it and I have no idea how to pronounce it it sounds so <laughs> it sounds so beautiful it looks so beautiful I'm like wow yeah. that's a language probably they have the same feeling towards Spanish <laughs> the Finns towards yeah, Spanish yeah exactly you know because for me Spanish no is like <laughs> you know it's easy no, not really like anyway <laughs> Here I think go. the Finns know they're special. All right. Standing so ovation for Boston defense. Yeah, great, great job for Boston. Ooh, yeah, wow. Well no, good job to both teams. <laughs> that was a hell of a match. Yes, because actually for the pressure that the Aussies were putting, that game could have been into 5-0 if the Boston wouldn't have been a good yeah, defending exactly. team. Yeah, I mean, they were, they were creating so much chaos and it's horrible for a team when you are behind and you are always reacting to the game. This is the right camera and we're trying to make it work. So that's look like a Picasso or, you know, artist work. It's, it's just a camera of the right hand <laughs> side that it kind of, uh, hopefully it didn't get water inside. But like in the whole game, the Aussies probably had 15 kind of like attempts at getting the goalie off the goal. You think, uh, sorry, one second, uh, Victor, you mean are there a technical difference between which countries? What did you just say? I was just saying in the last game, uh, yeah. there were probably about 15 times where the uh, Australians tried to um, get the Boston players yeah. off the goal. Yeah. And At least. Yeah. At least. And more only than 15. It only worked once. Yeah. <laughs> so I think, yeah, for yes. us, it's something we need to work on in terms of, um, you know, when you try and score a goal in practice, yeah. that's one thing, but scoring a goal in an actual game under high pressure. Um, yeah, that's a totally different thing, and it's all about you know angles and so positioning and all those really fine tuning things. Yes, and passing and the ball faster. Yeah. Because if you take too long, then you will be crap. Like yeah. it happened a lot of time. This, you know, the defender would grab and pull them up, yeah. and then you are off the wave you were building up, and you start from scratch somehow. But if you can keep the turning of the, like, have you seen the Castores game a yeah. little bit? Yeah. More like I that. Or the Colombians. I mean, yeah. of course, <laughs> it's like, it's easy seeing, seeing that, saying this, right? But you see that they, it's, it's, like, a, it's like a machine, you know? Yeah. It's like rrr, like a wheel. Yeah. Bap, bap, yeah. But when bap, they, you know, bap, bap, when they yeah. get a good chance yeah. of a goal, like one out of two times and one out of three times, uh, it will be a goal. Whereas we got a little bit more work to do. Bit, uh, let me see. Singapore and Switzerland. Ah, okay. Uh, yeah. Tactical. Well, the Faris, uh, they are new. And they. <laughs> I was just getting a. And the Swiss girls. This way? Uh, do I have something in my teeth? <laughs> <laughs> we have been photographed. <laughs> and they yeah, it looked like we had something in our teeth. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, was it you or me? <laughs> I have no idea. We, we can look. We can see here. Yeah. Uh, it's good. Yeah. <laughs> just 
stuff. So, okay. what is in Switzerland? I haven't seen the game of the Swiss girls so far, no, so I can't comment. this is the first time in a long time they've sent a team to Champions Cup. Um, the Swiss, yes, I know, yeah. but I haven't seen the games uh, that happened earlier today, so oh I right. don't have yeah in my mind because I was not commenting those games. And yesterday also not. So uh, I will see, and we can analyze the tactic and what which are the differences in this game. And also, it depends I think the tactics is just survival, yeah. <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> um, okay. I mean, it makes it makes a lot of it's sense like to talk about tactics, you <laughs> know, when talking about the top teams. But for like, you know, um, so sort of newer teams, like yeah, <laughs> tactics is just well, survival. Well, no, but Elvetia, I mean, the Swiss, the Swiss team is not really new. The problem is, is in all these years, having coming to the Champions Cup since at least since I was playing.